Bought this years ago, forgot I had it. They're never gonna come back again now. Yeah, it's got away from me a little bit there. Oh, so you're f***ing taking that off, James. Do I just keep, yeah, keep waving. Yeah, okay, keep waving. I just keep waving. <laughs> Did you hear me? Yeah, I did, yeah. How's it going, you alright? Yeah, where are you? You signing up? What's that? General. No, it's just my coat. It's a nice coat. Bought this years ago, forgot I had it. Found it recently. I'm wearing the same clothes that I wore yeah, the other day. Yeah, you see? See what happens when you show off too much? Huh? Then everybody knows you're wearing the same thing. Well, I've got to get another couple more wears out of these clothes, because if you wash your clothes too much, you ruin them. I'm mm. going to get changed. I don't feel good. You don't feel good about what you're wearing. And also, I've not time to do my hair. My hair's all frizzy. I'm anyway. having a bad hair day. Don't worry about it. We're off out. We're about to go and have some lunch. It's a Sunday afternoon. Sunday. We're going out with John and Claire. It's sort of like a belated birthday lunch, Yeah, because we didn't get to see them for my birthday, so we're going out a week later. I'm just going through the menu. Um, I like to... Just make sure that uh, I know exactly what I'm going to be having. So there's no faffing about. I think I'm going to go for the lobster thermidor. Um, lobster thermidor, some thrice cooked chips. Uh, sides, actually sides are important, aren't they? Okay, did you, we're vlogging right now. You can do that later. This is important, Claire. All right, we'll say I bye then. I don't, I don't, listen, I don't get people that turn up to restaurants uh, unprepared. Ah, uh, no. Have a little look at the menu before you have a little idea of what you want. I do sometimes. Because then what happens is you get into a situation, you sit down, you're there for about 10 minutes and they come over and you chat, everyone's chatting because we're all having, you know, oh, how are you? How's your week been? Yeah. No one even looks at the menu. Right. Then they come over and go, oh, do, do you need to... Right, but hold and then you on. go, yeah, I do need some more time. And you're thinking, well, they're never going to come back again now. We're going to be here for half an hour. But not everybody will have pre-decided. So you're going to have to wait anyway. But that's what I'm... But I'm doing the right thing. Right, okay. You should. You should have a little peruse It's James's of world. The menu. We all just live in it. Just have a little look at the menu and have an idea. It's hot in here. It is warm, yeah. I don't know whether it's hot or cold at the moment. It feels really hot, but it looks miserable outside. It's that I can't between. wait to see the sun again, Claire. It's depressing me. Right, I don't want to go to lunch with us, James. Hey, guys, yeah. welcome to this week's vlog. Thank you so much for watching. Thanks for joining us. Hope you're well. Hope you're good. Miserable Sunday. Rubbish Sunday. Absolutely terrible outside. I'm looking forward to, like, going outside, waking up on a Sunday. I know, yeah. Making a cup of tea or Hopping whatever it is you like to, and just sitting there yeah, in the I love garden. That. That's the one thing I do like about summer, the morning, where you can open the doors and go straight up. Good news is, is that we're off to one of my favourite restaurants. I cannot wait. Like I said, it's just your world. Lobster Thermidor. Going for the Lobster Thermidor. Don't know what to do about a starter, though. Okay. Might have the... Might go fish. Double up on fish. Go for that, those bits of scampi. Those were good. Yeah. Might go with that. It's fascinating stuff. I'm really, really excited. I can't wait to go go to this place. I'm wearing my, my military jacket, my little Sergeant Pepper's jacket. I'm gonna have to go and put my hair up and stuff. I'm not happy. I don't have a chance to do my hair. I'm not, I don't have an outfit I like. My hair is not sat right. It's not sat in the position. I can tell as soon as I get out of the shower and I dry my hair, then I look at it and I go, it's not sat. It's not gone right. As soon as I get out of the shower, I know that's it. I go, you're gonna have a bad one. Two days ago, I had a great hair day. Really good. What was I doing? Oh, I was um, doing. No, I was doing that thing for Jude during the, the oh, afternoon. Oh yeah. Hair. Primo. It was primo. Primo hair. <laughs> James says primo a lot. <laughs> right. Ironically. Yeah. Yeah, but when you say something too much, I ironically, know. it turns into um, when I say maron. I'm guilty of that. No, I no, I yeah, just yeah. say maron yeah. all the time. Now something happens, you're like you'll get into a car accident or something. Oh, maron. <laughs> Maybe not car accident. No, but you know, like someone will bump into your car or someone. Oh, will... maron. Oh, maron, I mean. I say it constantly. I do that. I start... And I started saying it as a joke because we were watching the yeah, Sopranos. Yeah, absolutely. And then it just. It's... And then it starts creeping. It's been years. In. It's been about 10 years now, oh, no. and I've been saying it constantly. I like your socks. Thanks. They're mine, are they not? Yeah, they are. That's why the heel's up here. Beatles socks. Right. Right, I need to quickly you, go in. You've got four minutes. Okay. You've got four uh, minutes. All right, I'll... I'll um, it's all right, I've got it, I've got it. You go. I'll, I'll, I'll hold it down here. Don't bore them I'm not going to bore them. All I'm going to say... annoy the shit out All them. I'm going to say is, is that we're going to go and have some lunch. Um, no, we well, might, I'm go, I'm we might take some pictures of the food or something so you can see it <laughs> depending on how much food i've eaten because well, well the, I, I have a sort of threshold once i have too much food then i'm um 
I'm ready to go to sleep. Uh, it happens to me a lot actually at restaurants. Like sometimes you have to go quite far for a restaurant. I have all that food and I just go, oh man, I'd love to just roll over now and just fall asleep. Might pick it up tonight, but I probably will just go straight to bed after, after lunch because I'd have just put myself into a food coma. If not, we'll see you tomorrow. That was all I wanted to say. Didn't, that wasn't boring, was it? It was just information. What do you think of the coat there? Trendsetter. Trendsetter Buckley. Can't see it now, can you, obviously? Need someone to hold the camera so you can get a f Anyway, it doesn't matter. Go and have some food. See you in a bit. Morning! Oh, not ready! Well, get ready. It's Monday morning. I think I ate too much food last night, uh, yesterday, yeah. at that restaurant. I made myself yeah. ill. It's good though. Food was great, meal was brilliant. I just ate too much of it. I had my starter, then I finished Claire's starter for her. Then I had my meal, had every last piece of that. Then I finished Harrison's meal for him. And then I was even tempted to get a yeah, to get a chocolate brownie. I'm glad I didn't. Yeah. Because I felt just a bit rotten last night. Went to bed so early. Just had to go to sleep. You never learn. I had, um, had about 20 rennies. But... Are you, are you feeling alright this morning? Feeling alright. It's a sunny day, Claire. It is sunny. It's quite nice, isn't it? Which means I'm getting in that garage. I'm getting in the garage. So... I can't get that, I've got some coals and stuff. Yeah, there. well you do that. Oh! And I'll go, I'll do the garage. I'm daddy's in the bathroom. Right, I'm gonna get in that garage. You can't even get in this garage. It's Halloween decorations from last year that need to go away. Christmas, yeah, no, it is a, yeah. It's a, uh, yeah, it's got away from me a little bit there. So, better sort that out, hadn't I? Right, I'm gonna sort the garage out. See you in a bit. Right, cleared some space out in the garage there. That's pretty much job done. Or, what normal people would say, job half done. Uh, still got this, this needs to go in the loft. Other Halloween stuff needs to go in the loft. Couple of bits of Christmas stuff still left there. But I've done what I needed to do, which was I needed a path to be able to get in. And there's still a load of crap here. I just needed a path to be able to get in and get to my fridge, because this is where I like to put my perfect draft kegs. And because the garage has been so sort of heaving chock-a-block, I've not been able to buy any kegs and put it in my fridge for a while. So that was it really, that was all I really wanted to do. I've got a couple of boxes, a few bits of cardboard and stuff that I need to take to um, the recycling centre and success, successful day. Could have done this, could have, feel like I could have. Feel like this patch here, if I spent three minutes on this. I feel like I could clear all that. I'm just not going to. All right, I'm gonna make myself some lunch. See you in a bit. All right, what we got going on here? Doing a podcast. Little, sli little set up. Yeah. Doing a podcast this uh, this morning. Yes. Was it Tuesday? Tuesday today. This There's another podcast tomorrow. Yeah, this vlog goes out tomorrow. I don't think we've vlogged enough this week. No, probably not. Yeah, don't worry about it. Right, look at the way I'm dressed because I was planning on not being seen from the waist up. Also, you're f***ing taking that off, James. What? The hat's bad enough. We're not doing a podcast with that on. Well, my hair's a mess, so I had to put a hat on. Well, you could have went for a quick shower. You'd No, hours. yeah, yeah, I could have done. I couldn't be bothered because I've got to have a shower tomorrow. Right, but take that off. If I shower too much, my skin gets all flaky. Right, I'll deal with the hat, but take that I've off. I've got a shower t tomorrow. We're you can keep talking over me, but I'm going to keep saying it. Tomorrow we're doing the Newlyweds podcast. Is that yeah. what it's called? Yeah. Newlyweds. Sick of podcasts. you got to do podcasts. I know. When I was promoting stuff with the in-betweeners and things like that, mm. that was really, really ever so boring. I much prefer the podcast route, go on people's podcasts, and you reach more people as well. 
Yeah, you reach way more people people than doing an interview with a newspaper or something like that. And it's just a bit more interesting, a bit more fun. Honestly, it's so much better than the old days of trying to promote stuff. And we'll go on. I'm not trying to promote anything. Yeah, we've got a podcast. Oh. And you never stop trying to promote that. Oh. You're always trying to get new people to listen. And this is just so much better than just going, just doing an interview or something. I know. We're doing, um, what's it called, this thing? It's called Two Doting Dads, A Couple of Guys in Australia. Do we need headphones? I hate those headphones. You've got to have headphones in, otherwise the audio They keep bleeds. falling out my ears. My ears are too wee. What time is it in Australia? It's late. So they'll be on the beers, won't they? Probably, yeah. Maybe I'll have one, just to make, you know, make sure they're not feeling self-conscious. Sure. So we've got that. That kicks off in about half an hour. Two Doting Dads. How did the... this come about? Um, he asked me, he DM'd me right. on Instagram and said, would love to get you and James. First of all, he just DM'd me after one of the YouTubes went up. And I think... <laughs> what was that sentence? He, he sent me a message. After the, one of the YouTubes. Has after one out. of the YouTube videos went up. He was just saying how much him and his wife love the vlogs. Alright, good. Um, like him. And then how much he loves the in between us and Good. big fan of right. you. Right, I'm liking him more and more. And then you were talking about Australia. Love Australia. And then he was like, "We should get you guys on the podcast." Perfect. I'm not very well today. Good. I'm about to uh, have a. I, I can feel it. I'm about to have a chest infection. Well, good because we've got a really busy week and a really busy weekend. Yeah. I'm a bit grumpy today. Yeah. I'm not well, well, always grumpy. Oh. I was confused. I didn't know what point you were making then. What questions are we going to be asked? How would you both go with parenting a kid like Jay from the Inbetweeners? I'd say that's genuinely... Um, if Is that I... it? You, just, you read one question, that's enough for you? That's it, yeah. No, but just um, just psychi- psych- psychiatry. Generally, if I had a child like Jay from the Inbetweeners, I'd be like, I need, You're going to, a I need to go to a doctor. <laughs> yeah. But the problem is you don't know what shit your kid is talking when you're not about. Kids don't lie in front of their parents. They don't they don't act all cool in front of their parents. It's when they're at school with their mates. Harrison does. Acts all cool in here. Yeah. Yeah, but he doesn't lie. Oh, you, do you remember that time when he said there was a bunch of girls waving at him from the, <laughs> when he was in a classroom? Can't put that in, bless him. I was going to a bunch of girls. It was as if it was Beatlemania. Or, yeah, like in, in the way he was describing it. It's like... No, you turned it into that. Harry no. was just saying there was some girls calling him today. And he, he was like, all right, ladies. Yeah. The worst lies told and he's sticking to it is that time he flew. Oh, my God. <laughs> Harrison's convinced that he flew once. He flew for, for three, three seconds. seconds. <laughs> we were like, so you jumped. He went, no, no, no. I don't, it was, he was different. Going, it was and different. he's dead serious. He's like, I don't know what happened. I just sort of like floated for a bit. Yeah, we should maybe reconsider that therapy. Maybe, yeah. yeah. Is this, do you reckon this poncho is all right or shall I put a different one on? Shall if you've bought another one, have you bought another no, one? No, I only need one. You only need one poncho. Right, we're going to do a podcast. And then I'm off to Jude's school. He's doing a little performance yeah, today. I'm not going to be able to see it. He's playing the bass. Yeah, I'm going to. little spring concert. I can't watch it because I've got to go and do the school run for the other fella. <laughs> The one that can... F- I mean, he could just fly on, <laughs> couldn't he? I'm missing Jude's performance, which I'm really gutted about, especially because it's to do with instruments and music I'll and stuff. I'll record and... it for you. Right, let's do this podcast. Maybe we'll roll it for a little while, since we've got... Oh, we've, we've, going yeah, on. we've got to. Yeah, we, we, okay. we've got to. Am I recording? Jesus, I had a heart attack then. It's a, it's a bit more difficult to see on this camera. It is, on yeah, the old camera, it was a big red dot. There was a little come blinking up. red dot, yeah. which you famously, I kept thinking it was in, the our, battery. in our very first vlog, you were going, oh, the battery's running out already. <laughs> yeah. I've seen it quite a few times. I need to set up this microphone. And, Wait, we'll uh, do it because you've got 25 minutes. Yeah. Right, we're all set up. I've had to take the poncho off. You happy? Yeah. Well, the hat's still on, but yeah. All right, let's do. Oh. Um... What do you want? Do you want big headphones that go nuts. around your head? I can give you those. Stay right. join. So what you need to do is is actually if they're falling out, it's because you need bigger. It's because the holes are too big. You need bigger things so that they squeeze. We well, just hurry up and process. Saying. Join studio.
Put yours in. What? Put yours in. Oh, I'm gonna eat this. <laughs> eat this and then start editing. What have you made? Chicken oh. soup? No, that is a, just a bog standard carbonara sauce that I'm uh, just heating up. Jar carbonara? Yeah. Ugh. Can't make your own cheese sauce yet? No. Not that carbonara is a cheese sauce. But I'm just making a little carbonara. I'm just heating this up a little bit. Well, nobody else is having any. No, it is all for me. We don't we don't um, have that rule in our house anyway, do we? What? You can't dip the spoon, like eat off the oh, spoon and then put it back in. It's just if, for us. If I, yeah, if I had other people coming yeah. over, I wouldn't do that. I've probably accidentally done it. I wouldn't do it. And I look for people if I go to someone else's house. Do you, do you look, watch them? Yeah, I watch them. I go, what are you doing in Spain? That podcast was good, wasn't it? Well good, yeah. Really nice, nice lads. Yeah. Nice guys. The guy I follow, I, I just checked because his name's not Ash on Instagram. His name's Jam Pikelets. Okay. On Instagram, so if you want to go and check him out, that's who we were. That's who did that. Are you done with this heat? Yeah. That is a big old bowl of pasta. That's it, mate. That's all I'm eating today. A great big bowl of pasta. Great big massive bowl of pasta. Do you put cheese on top? Nope. Put a load of salt in it because I made this yesterday and it didn't taste anything. Should put some pepper on it as well. That's why I got that. Pepper on the top. You guys like the ski vlog? Which oh, is yeah. good. Really great. Thanks so much, guys, that, that watched that. Obviously, it was a sponsored vlog for us, and we were trying to do um, a job for people. And you watching it and commenting and stuff really, really helps us out. And yeah. we genuinely really, really like the company, and we wanted to try and do the best job we could for them. We had an amazing time. Yeah, it was great. And we are going to be going. And back. if you are thinking about it, I, I've seen a few people have sent me messages and comments and stuff. If you are thinking about it, I would genuinely say do it. Yeah. Genuinely Absolutely say do brilliant. it. Absolutely Even if you're not great at skiing, it's such a good. Oh, you will do. You like a couple of hours time, you'll get you'll get the hang of it, and it will feel like even though on the vlog it didn't look like it, it'll feel like you're going about 120 oh, miles an that's hour. That's one thing that really Claire was annoyed, well annoyed me. So Claire was when, so annoyed. When I was going to those big hills when we went up in the mountain bit and skied down and then there was that big hill honest to god you were going so fast and then on camera it doesn't look like you've gone fast like i was like scared i was gonna fall over i was gonna crash into something yeah it looks like you're going at like a snail's pace you're not but anyway yeah thanks for uh liking that vlog right i'm gonna eat i'm gonna go and let james eat look at him he's itching i'm gonna eat i'm gonna watch a little episode of seinfeld I'm gonna go. I need to go to Judd's school. You gotta go now? Yeah. Hey. All right. Well, we'll pick this up probably we'll see this evening. Later. Yeah, see them later. Right then, guys. James is about to have his, uh, I mean, how often are you supposed to have a haircut? I feel like you get your haircut all the time. Uh, was it three weeks ago? Yeah. Isn't it only supposed to be like, how often do men get their haircut? Is it more often than that? Six weeks. No. Yeah, no, I was gonna guys. say six weeks. Well, that's if you've got slightly longer hair. Guys are getting a haircut once a week. Oh, okay. If they've got like a short, neat haircut and they want to keep on top of it. True. Know, like every Friday night, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just before they head up. Anyway, Toby's here and he's going to start cutting James's hair. Since we're uh, <laughs> running low on content, I thought I would vlog it. I've been trying to grow some length to get a bit more sort of shaggy looking. Mm -hmm. But now I feel... You should try and grow some length. I'm trying to, uh, I'm wondering whether I've lost my way a little bit. I uh, quite like how it looks right now. You do, yeah? Yeah. It was cut See, about was, three weeks ago. I yeah, know, so. yeah. See, I'm wondering whether keeping all this, keeping the back, but then tidying up around right, the yeah. ears, so it has that mod. So it's just a bit tighter. So it has yeah. that mod look again. Just slightly longer at the moment, version. It's, it's all sort of. Not really, but it's sort of getting to that point where it's all one length. They're just cut around the ear. Yeah, absolutely. But I don't really want to lose any of this. No, we'll just razor it around the ear. But I don't know... Um, more texture at the top razor as well. Razor it around the ear? I don't think you've ever done that before, no. have you? What do you think, Claire? I don't know, mate. I don't think it'll be clean out around the ear. I think it has... It could go a bit, sort of... We don't want it to turn into, like, a bob length. Yeah. 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 So, uh, yeah, I mean, definitely. It's starting to look like that bloke from No Country for Old Men. <laughs> yes. Um, <laughs> I don't know what that is, but yeah, I want to um, just tidy it up around the ears. All right, because then that will make it look a bit slimmer. Yeah, I'm gonna set you up here, and we'll do this a fast little do a time, little time lapse. lapse then. Yeah, two time lapse in one vlog means. Why? What did we time lapse? Our time lapse us doing the podcast. Oh, of course. Yeah. So you know yeah. that that means we're struggling. It's a slow week. <laughs>
was that oh, it? Go on, was that it? Was that nearly it? That was nearly it. That was some grapes. Yeah. We are... Different kind of grapes this time on the At Home with the Buckleys. Oh, I was enjoying them until you said that. You look very pretty, Claire. Thanks, mate. About to do a podcast, don't we? Yeah, we're doing another one of the big podcasts. We've done the therapy crouch. Done the therapy crouch. We've done... Um, We've done parenting in hell. Parents in hell. But today we're doing... Jamie and Sophie are uh, newlyweds. Be good, is, wouldn't it? Which is one of the big boys again, I think. Yeah. How's my hair looking? Primo. Is it primo? <laughs> yeah, get a shot of me. <laughs> it's so well, I've got a, you know. There he is. Oh, it's not looking good. Before and before. <laughs> After and before. Um, Looks the same. No, it's subtly different. Is it? Yeah. Okay. Why have you taken the stand off this? We could have started it done for a because second. Because I'm taking this with us. Because I've got to get some vlogging done. By the way, this is the morning of when this vlog goes out. Yeah, it's Wednesday. I'm going to be editing this on the train, if it's not too busy. You're going to be one of the guys no. with his laptop out. Yeah. Very important. Yeah. If taking it's, up space. If it's an empty train. Right. If it's a busy train, I won't do it. I'll right. wait until I get home and just rush something. And yeah. Do you know what? Sometimes I just think, um, why do we bother? making an effort because some stuff we've rushed and some stuff we've made an effort it's the same in some fact, stuff we've really stressed out about mo most scrapped the, a load of things yeah most of the time where i feel like oh this is a really boring terrible vlog people are like this was my favorite i know and i'm like okay i don't know the rules i don't either right taxi's here yeah um let's go yeah because i need to put stuff in my bag you need to go and put stuff in your bag right let's go and um and we'll do an outro from the newlyweds podcast okay we'll do a little outro there and maybe get um oh it's gonna be embarrassing some celebrities to stand next to us <laughs> okay. or something i don't know <laughs> just you're to more, try you're and... more famous than me well i'm just i don't think so no you're no. not as relevant but you're more famous i've never been relevant but also i think you tell someone's fame by how many instagram followers they've got oh okay well they're winning then. they've got to have more aren't they oh yeah definitely. right we'll see you in a bit What's yeah. that? Why don't you and Jamie just do it? We'll just oh, do just it. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Right. Yeah. What, well, did, you, what listen, did you want to say, James? Well, I just wanted to... I'm crowbarring you in here, <laughs> right? Yeah. The, I, I've edited this vlog so far and the footage is awful. Yeah. So I'm hoping that you here will inject a bit of excitement. <laughs> okay. uh, so This will uh, be the fun now. This is the thumbnail. How was the podcast? Did you think it went Oh, around? yeah. I really enjoyed myself. Yeah. I think I might have overshared a bit much. You did, much. yeah. We'll see We'll see if they ever hear that. <laughs> I won't listen to the edit. I'm cool with. I stand by everything I say. <laughs> I also just can't get over my the fact. I just. I still. It lives in my head free now. The fact that you watch a quiet place, too. <laughs> yeah. And at the ending, have you seen it where he mouth? What does he mouth? He's, he's, he's like, I love you or something. I'll be standing again. This is your fault. <laughs> you did this. <laughs> well all, done. All you had to do. Was shut just the keep up. your mouth. Would shut. you? Would you mouth? Would you mouth at your kids? Yeah. Absolutely, yeah. yeah, I would. You guys enjoyed the podcast, right? It was Absolutely. so good. It was really, really good. So, yeah, I mean, I'm sure you don't need me to say this, but check out Newlyweds now. Yeah, there it is. Was that annoying? Change it, yeah. yeah. It was annoying. Yeah. Because yeah. Nearlyweds. Yeah. Nearlyweds is a great title. Yeah. 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 Newlyweds is just Newlyweds. It's just Newlyweds. <laughs> but we, we, couldn't, <laughs> uh, we, uh, we couldn't keep it as Nearlyweds, could we? Well, no, because we were married. married. Yeah. 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 We nearly put it as nearly divorced. And she didn't like that. I thought cheese. that was good. I wanted to be nearly divorced. I thought that would be a funny one. Wow. But you didn't like it. You said it was negative. That's we're, what we should have we're always called on the edge, yeah. yeah, yeah. Because then we could have done like nearly, nearly parents, and then nearly dead. Yeah, nearly dead. Nearly dead. That's good. That's James's other we're all thing. Nearly dead, aren't we? He loves that. He would just be standing That's in the kitchen saying, one day, it? and he's and I'm like, "You all right? How are you feeling?" He's like, "Well." Be over soon. It's just a slow. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a slow walk to the grave, isn't it, Claire? Sometimes you suggest things that go well. That will kill a bit of time, won't it? Before. The inevitable. I actually had that for a bit. I had a really depressing bit for a bit where I was just like, someone's like, we should do that. I was like, it doesn't really matter, does it? No, it just, doesn't matter. just try and fill your time with as much fun stuff as possible. <laughs> it's better than doing nothing. On that note, James, On say that bye. Note, I'll say goodbye. <laughs> Bye. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Subscribe. Go and check out um, Newlyweds as well. We'll link the podcast. Absolutely. We'll do yeah. That. Do I just I keep, yeah, keep waving. Yeah, keep okay, waving. I just keep waving. Bye. 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 <laughs>